y'all, hey y'all, welcome to my channel, Space Goddess Gypsy Oracle, let me do something real quick, uh, sit back, relax, and enjoy the ride, I can't really sleep, I feel like I took a nap, but it's so weird because I was tired, and it didn't happen, so here I am, I'm awake, I'm gonna pull one of these, and then we're gonna build from it. This is the um, the metaphysical cannabis oracle deck. Now I went on a hiatus. I told y'all in a different video. I went on a hiatus from smoking. Okay, it will be temporary. What's this? Compassion. Okay, that's the energy that you need to hold. What is this energy for? Timeless. So whenever you see this. Okay, have a little bit of compassion. Okay, you may be trying to uh, diet. This is food meditation. Maybe you're trying to detox. Maybe you're going vegan. But whatever it is, it has something to do with your diet. Um, have a little bit of compassion for yourself if you're trying to um, change your diet. And don't be rigid, okay? Make the foods you like alternatively. I was watching um, Lyle Lyle Crocodile on um, Netflix. Yes, they turned Lyle Lyle Crocodile into a musical, okay? It's, I, I'm a sucker for nostalgia, okay? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. I'm a sucker for nostalgia, and I think I even cried at the end, okay? I think I cried at the end, okay? Um have a little bit of compassion for yourself but there's also a, um, a part in the the movie where she was feeling some type of way because she was changing her diet she was um, looking for more uh, no she had um, you know you know you know y'all know what's going on with the food industry and how people are looking to um, eat healthier and remove some of the bad ingredients out of the out of their diet and stuff like that. She was one of them people. She was doing stuff like that, and she was also a um, chef or a cook or whatever. She had a cookbook or some shit like that, and she um, she had a cookbook, a couple of cookbooks. And she was feeling some type of way because she wanted to, I guess she wanted to write another cookbook or she had stopped baking or something like that because she couldn't make the things that she wanted to make. Um, make those things. Just swap up the ingredients. They may not taste the same, but they could taste similar, okay? And they might even be better than what you thought it would be. You know what I'm saying? I really do like reading in the middle of the night look every time i pull for y'all there's a king of pentacles in coming out of this deck this is scorpio's energy this is scorpio's energy you're gonna have a victory when it comes to your wealth okay and it has something to do with you walking away okay yep you could even be coming into some money and deciding to leave something behind because we're talking about Scorpios, okay? Scorpios coming out as a king of pentacles. That's why. What is this? You could have a lover from your past life. The king of pentacles really could be your lover, okay? You could be leaving for someone for your past. I said what I said. I don't remember. But you remember. <laughs> somebody wants to work on... <laughs> somebody wants to work on... Um, building a happy family. They want to create a family with you. Um, they want to maintain a happy family with you. But it looks like they want to collaborate with you to build... An abundant and happy life okay abundant with the ten of Pentacles the Sun here okay three of Pentacles okay collaboration working together consultation okay this also I know it's the Hierophant but this also looks like um, this could also be counseling as well 
okay with the one person here okay and then the other two people here because they have this paper here like can you look at this can you see what's going on and he's working you know what i'm saying so somebody could be even seeking out like some therapy a consult seriously because this is going over here spirit said put it over here because that's where the cards fell and I told you I got these nails from Five Below and I wasn't a fan of them because my nail bed is rounded. It's a lot more rounded at the top and slimmer. So um, regular nails from the store don't really fit me and I don't really buy them. But I did. I usually do my own nails. I usually do my own nails. <laughs> and it works out for me, but I ain't been feeling like it. Oh, I'm watching, I'm listening to Morphe. That's the channel. The song is called Tex. Or the upload is called Tex Goodstone 2023. Full album. It was uploaded five days ago. Alright. Hmm. Working hard. Okay. Just trying to make a decision. Uh, about cutting something off, cutting somebody off, or a queen of swords. Oh, sorry. Working. This could also be, you know, your craft, your skill. Maintaining your craft. This is on top of the eight of cups. Okay, so you cutting motherfuckers out of your energy it's like you have to build momentum to do this you may also suffer from anxiety um i know i've um i've I, my anxiety used to be really bad but i have taken control over my anxiety sometimes i feel it but it's not my energy because 717 on the timer because i would have no reason I would have no reason for this anxiety. You know what I'm saying? I would have no reason for this anxiety. And I would be like, well, what is this? I know this energy ain't mine. I know this energy ain't mine. You know, something was a burden, okay? Something was a burden, Scorpio. What is this? Is that why you ended up cutting these people off or cutting this energy off? What? What are we leaving behind? Are you leaving behind? Wait a minute, wait a minute. I feel like I need to start all over. Okay, you said you're com you're having compassion, right, for yourself because you're out here trying to change your diet and eat better, right? May even do a detox or go vegan or, or change some shit like that because I know I was just talking about, um, I know I was just talking about meatless chili on my YouTube, okay? I mean, not YouTube, but on TikTok. But you can be in this King of Pentacles status, right? You could have came into some funds. You're grounded, okay? You chilling, all right? Maybe even gotten a new job with this King of Pentacles uh, Six of Wands. And now you're like walking away from some sort of emotional turmoil, right? Okay? It could even be a job that you're walking away from, okay? Or this is you just walking away from um, emotional turmoil and focusing on building your craft. And you're walking away and cutting this energy off because it was a burden. Now, I don't know. It could be a family situation. It could be this King of Pentacles that you're walking away from. Okay? But it's somebody that you have a... Um, it's somebody that you could have a family with. Somebody that you may have a past life with. Somebody that you grew up with. Whoever this is, this person could be a... Um, one of your soulmate twin flames. Now, I was listening to another reader and she had mentioned um, the different soulmates. Now, I used to talk about this on, um, I used to talk about this on live. I don't know if I've mentioned it recently, but you do get different soulmates and twin flames in your lifetime because when you guys come into you're in coming to union you're supposed to ascend together 
right? Now, if another person doesn't ascend and they don't fulfill their mission, then they lose their position. Just like a regular job, right? If you ain't working, you ain't doing your job properly, you lose that job, right? Right. So that's how it is with your twin flame, soulmate, however you want to call it. If somebody doesn't ascend and everybody gets time, everybody gets everybody has a time limit okay so if somebody doesn't pass that time limit and that person loses their position and then you get a new a new um a new counterpart who may be on your level or above your level but you will still that old person may still be trying to come into your life and if you're out and about you may continue to um come into contact with partners who still hold the energy of your previous soulmate all that's a test all that's a test so you, you turn down these karmic because they turn karmic right so you turn down all these energies and once you turn down all these energies and you're able to recognize these energies that are no longer good for you 11 11 on the timer spirit will then bring you your new soulmate your new twin flame your new partner who was on the uh same energetic level or higher as you okay that was a lot i hope you guys can hear me i'm gonna try to adjust the sound when i do this video now somebody's gonna come in they want to take action because you've said away, said away. You said that in the last video. You sailed away. They take an action, but look at this. It looks like they're too late, though. You see? Because he's this person isn't even facing in the same. They're not even. I can understand if it was like this. It's like, oh no, don't go. They're trying to stop you. But this is like they missed the bus. They missed the bus. Oh, I missed the bus. They missed the bus. This is like in the movies when like, you know, the lover gets the new job to in another city, in another state, in another country, and they've broken up or whatever, and, and this energy finds out that this person is moving away, and then they try to catch him at the airport, and they miss the airport, Right? But do they really miss the airport, though? You know what I'm saying? That's the cliffhanger. Do they miss the airport? Yep. Because you've healed. They missed, they missed the bus. They missed the airport. It's in reverse. The ship's not coming in. And I don't read these in reverse. Y'all, I told y'all, I keep telling y'all already. I don't read these in reverse, and this deck is in reverse. So this is like, your ships are coming in, this is like the ship ain't coming in. They missed the bus. You took that leap of faith because you've healed spiritually in a big way, in a big, big way. And I think that is beautiful. That is so beautiful. So you out here, 13.33 on the timer, so you out here doing what's right for you. I love it. I love it. This could even end up being a new divine counterpart that is from like your past life. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, you you could have had different lovers in a past life. It don't just have to be one lover in the past life. You know what I'm saying? True. I mean, I guess it doesn't matter. I see him when I see him. Yeah, this could even be the person that you left behind, and this could be, or this could be the new person. Take it how it resonates. Moving forward. Come on now, taking action and moving forward. This is the, the fool. You've taken action on your healing, okay? You could also be doing what I'm doing. You might even have a platform with the high priestess and the star. You might even gotten a, 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 a position. I'm... 
I love her. Okay, so don't take offense. I'm here and coming now for y'all free reading. Just don't let the motherfucker scam you, okay? Don't let the motherfucker scam you. So you may even get a position um, doing something spiritually. Take it how it resonates. If it resonated, it resonated. Don't it don't. It might not be that you get a, pos a spiritual position. It may just be you getting, you know, just leaving. Because you've healed yourself from trauma and heartache and sadness. I'm hungry. I'm gonna um I'm gonna throw some chili in the crock pot before I go upstairs. I really don't want to though because then I'm gonna have to cut up uh, onion. Well, not really. I don't cut up onions. I use like the big. You know how they come apart. Well, I use I don't cut them up because I don't eat them. There's a whole story behind that. It's um it's a sensory thing, I guess. I don't like the texture of um, I don't like the texture of onions. <laughs> I don't like the texture. Like I'll eat some cabbage, some lettuce, but an onion, nope, nope. I'll even like I sometimes still try to mix in the cabbage with the strips of onion. Nope, I ain't with that shit either. I wanted to make this short because I'm tired. Yeah, man, you had to fight. People were trying to steal from you. You had to stand your ground. People were trying to take from you and betray you. That's exhausting. That's exhausting. Okay? That is so exhausting. You might even have to um, fight your, your spiritual beliefs as well. It ain't nobody's business what you believe in. It ain't nobody's business as long as you ain't hurting nobody. You know what I'm saying? People don't understand that shit. Yeah, man. You're going to be coming into an abundance. And I love to see it. And they, the motherfuckers was trying to take it from you. And have you leaving out. And have you out in the cold and shit. Okay. Yeah man. It could have been a king of cups. It could have been some. Let me get another. Let me get another card for this king of cups. Because I need to verify his energy. Let me use it with the witch's tarot. Because remember. I don't um, read cards in reverse. So I need to go off for the next card. That comes next. Next come next to determine whether or not he is a karmic if this is a karmic king of cups this this could be you coming out here mastering your energy mastering your emotions excuse me I just want one hold on I wish it was water. I don't drink faucet water because it makes me sick. We were raised on distilled. So when I drink faucet water, it makes me ill. And we're out of water. Yep. Oh my gosh. Look, 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 look. Karma. Mm, 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 mm. Mm, 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 mm. Ace of Swords. Confirmation. Look. King of Cups. Wow. Wow. You sailing away, my guy. You sailing away. You sailing away because you've mastered your emotions. Okay? And there was another energy here that's getting their karma because they were trying to have you left out in the cold and take from you and have you left out in the cold. Okay? From, and you're going to get your happiness. You're going to receive your happiness. This abundance is going to bring you happiness. This deck is so tiny. You know I have a different deck. I have a holographic um, Rider weight deck. And I use that as my clarifier. But this is this is nice. I can use this deck as a clip. As a clarifier. Come on Scorpio. Come on now. Let's get into it. Ace of Pentacles, Ace of Pentacles. Let's get one more. Yep, Six of Swords. Because you're sailing away. I know that's right. Spirit going to give you your um, gifts. Whatever this is, whatever this move is, it's going to bring you happiness. Here we go again. Seven of Wands. With the Seven of Swords together. Come on. Come, Spirit. Man, and the Eight of Pentacles. Come on, you've been working hard on your craft. And you had to defend what's yours because they was trying to take from you. You know, 
I love it when spirit comes and confirms these cards for me like this. Because sometimes I still be unsure. I love reading tarot. I love reading tarot. But I'm not like seasoned like I've been reading for five, ten years. Well, I don't think it's been five yet. I think it's, I, I confirmed it's been about three years now that I've officially been reading for the public. Um, but I always been into it. I I learned by watching because you know Scorpios we we research and then we come a little bit of we become a little bit obsessive and tarot was is my obsession I love it I love it this is art I love to paint I took many art classes in school I love the fact that I can pick up these cards and read these beautiful pictures these beautiful pieces of art and tell stories with them you know what I'm saying this is a beautiful thing this is a beautiful gift and I'm so thankful to have received it I feel so thankful and you know one thing one thing's for sure and two things for certain I, I do love being up late at night reading tarot because there's no distractions it's quiet because I'm nocturnal um, it's quiet I I love it there's no children running around the TV is off I got the music on you know the world my world is sleeping 2121 and this is the time where spirit can actually talk to me without interruptions you know what I'm saying and I love it I love it I, I'm, I'm about to get all teary eyed and shit telling y'all about my passion you're going to be getting a new house you may feel stuck right now you may be getting a new house or a father could be buying a new house out Maybe he's getting kicked out of a house because it's on top of the Five of Pentacles. Something about the imagination or a never-ending story. Some sort of cycle. Some sort of cycle that either this father continues to be in. A cycle that you are in. Whatever this cycle is. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, whatever this cycle is needs to be closed out. There's a cycle that needs to be closed out. Because somebody is under judgment, okay? They have no spiritual guidance. And they may be feeling stuck. Sometimes I'll be feeling stuck, but spirit be like, snap out of it, girl. Because <laughs> it's winter time. I hate being a... I, I be saying stuff and then I be forgetting. I say it like I hate being outside in the cold. I hate the winter time. And spirit be like, okay, well, if you hate the winter time, sit in the house. <laughs> Shh. Ooh, divine masculine has a secret. Okay, this secret will be revealed soon enough. This card means soon. Okay, this is my divine masculine. Ooh, divine masculine over here taking up the reading. Something is about to be scrambled. Every time I hear, every time I see this, I get static. This is some sort of static interference or interruption or some shit like that. Okay, something about the summertime. There may have been some sort of static interference with an uncle. You could have started a new store. You could be looking for starting a new store. Yeah, you could have started a new business that has something to do with retail. Or you will be starting a business that has something to do with retail. Maybe buying and selling herbal remedies. Do that shit. Do that shit. Do that. We talked about that yesterday. Yeah, it was yesterday. Well, I posted the video yesterday. Okay? 2-2-2. Two, two, two. It is 2-2-2 two, two, two a.m. Okay? Something about a grandpa. 
I was thinking about mine today. I need to call them. Um, how someone feels about you is not your business. Okay. Maybe you, you're trying to figure out whether or not somebody grandpa like you or not. Maybe it's the Von Masculine's grandpa or not. It's who cares? All right. Your transgressions will follow your soul into eternity. Damn. Okay. You could possess dragon energy. You could be activating your dragon energy. Dragon energy is fierce and powerful. Okay. People, you scare people with your energy. Your voice can burn down entire communities. Okay. You may even have some sort of activist energy within you. You may not like, you may not you know be an activist like outside and and marching and shit but you may be standing up for the underdog you know what i'm saying stolen inheritance will be returned with haste i told you everyone has a miss I'm, I'm trying to tell you everyone has a mission in this world not all of it is divine spiritual bullies will be exposed time's up a new life awaits you. Oh, I like this. I, this is going to be my title. Time's up. A new life awaits you. Yep. 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 You're going to be coming into, um, you're going to be meeting new people. You're going to be meeting new people. Social status. Your social status could be changing. You can be meeting more um, professional people. Okay. You could be um, um, something about the thrusted. That's the word. Thrusted into the public. Um, with your success and your careers. Oh, I turned off my earbuds. I hope you can hear me better. This is going to happen during a full moon. Under the moonlight. During a full moon. And it's going to come right on time. Okay? It's going to come right on time. You may need to do some Bibliomancy and Jonah. Okay? The most times on the other side. Alright? You got big shit popping. Or you will. Or you will have big shit popping. Okay? Land travel. Bus, car, motorcycle. What else is on land? Bus, car, motorcycle. Moped, roller skates. I don't know. Whatever it is you're, tra you're traveling. Somebody's worried and confused about what? What they worried and confused about? Somebody's magic. Because the craft is on the other side. I looked at it. Um, <laughs> if I don't read the other side... It means um, I ain't seen it. No, if I read the other side, it means I looked at the, the back of the card. Okay? That means read it. Um, and I've seen this one, nothing but mind games. So somebody's worried and confused because they've been playing. Um, uh, they're worried about your magic because they have been doing magic on you. But it's been mental magic with mind games, says the craft. Okay? Y'all know what happened in the craft. Okay? Nancy and her girls was trying to mind fuck Sarah when she didn't want to play with them anymore, okay? So you might not want to play with somebody no more and now they want to play games with your mind, all right? Somebody with short hair, okay? They could be born in the year of the rooster, okay? Or they could just uh, uh, possess these energies. Um, observant, hardworking, and courageous. They could be born in 57, 69, 81, 93, 2005, could have a child born in 2017. Somebody wants to be just like you, okay? Something about the Orisha. You could be a practitioner. This could be who you worship, who you pray to, the deities you work with. Something about a crisis. About gunshot, okay? Um, it has to do with mental health. Cause this is mental magic this is oh what so wow mm, hold on let me look at these real quick let me look at these real quick before i say i don't i don't know interesting i don't know i don't i don't know what i want to say i kind of do though so you may have done a return to sender, right? I told you they was playing with your mind, right? You could have done a return to sender. Somebody may... <sighs> I 
God, y'all be having me say these, these, all this. Okay, like I said, I said, this is real life. People do real, real things. People hurt themselves. They take themselves out. People go through happiness. People go through sadness. People go through dark nights of the souls and they can't get out of them. Somebody got a return to sender and it dragged them down. Ooh. I was about to say drag them down to hell, but I didn't want to say drag them down to hell. They dragged them down to the dark night of the soul and they could not handle it. They could not handle it and they took themselves out because their mental magic was not strong enough to for them to actually, um, they could dish it out, but they couldn't handle it. You know what I'm saying? Something like that. Someone has your picture, something about a lake. Okay, they might have been trying to do uh, magic at a lake with your picture. You could be a metaphysicist. Okay, um, you're getting uh, love sent from the divine. Um, they're blocked from their energy. I don't know who's blocked from their energy. Okay, um, you will gain insight to an alternative choice. Okay, um, <laughs> because you about to hit a gold mine. I know that's right. Something that has to do with your creativity and your desires. Something that you've been manifesting, okay? And also connect with water. Make sure you're taking your spiritual baths. Damn it, somebody's going to be having an, a baby, okay? And Anubis is coming away your heart. There's a feminine energy who's an op, okay? And somebody, um, you don't even know them. And they don't even know you. It could be an earth sign. Um, that's like, she used to call me on my cell phone, but, 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 but whenever she need or he needed my love, call me on my cell phone and you don't even know them and they don't even know you. So somebody could be lying on your name. Somebody could be lying on your name now. Somebody dolphin. Okay. I don't want to read all this here. Your bills will be paid in advance. You need to get that person out of your space. Okay? Something about during a birthday. So if you're having a birthday party and somebody's on bullshit, get them out of there. Okay? Somebody's stuck in an old paradigm and doesn't plan on shifting. That's what I'm trying to tell you. I said what I said. Alright? And their confusion spells are not working. Alright? That's how that shit is returning to sender. And they're going to have their own crisis by gunshot um or this could be a different kind of crisis by a gunshot but that's not what i said um proverbs do some bibliomancy okay somebody is going to be in witness protection that could be spiritually or physically somebody is on some hard drugs um don't be scared to cry out loud okay if things if you're hurting don't be scared to cry out loud someone is in the energy of sodom and gomorrah Ooh. Somebody may something in something. Oh, wow! This looks. This is intense. Can can we get out of this darkness? All right, Sodom and Gomorrah. There were two cities of sin. They were practicing bestiality and they were doing um these things. Okay. This could be somebody in your energy too, because this is like somebody under your roof is giving you the evil eye they could be experiencing a lot of losses okay they could be trying to give you the evil eye something about may they could be a gemini okay splice they're creating shit and dumping into the ocean i don't know why you need to know that but here that is there okay black holes you're in complete denial about a wealthy man an old friend is one of your stalkers. Thank you. You're welcome. Somebody doesn't like having sex with you or you don't like having sex with this person. But it's a lie because your body is a wonderland for real because I looked at it. Okay, Haggai, Haggai, um, protect your peace. And somebody drives a Hyundai, a Buick, a GMC, Toyota, Volkswagen, Mazda, or Lincoln. They drove that shit into the desert, okay? Somebody could be working at the soup kitchen or you're going to uh, the soup. Oh, somebody's at the soup kitchen. So somebody got left behind. 
um, and they may be homeless or some shit like that. And um, she big mad that uh, he left her because something about um, something about what it looks like on the outside. You know what I'm saying? What something looks like on the outside. Something about North Modeling Industry. We got that already. I thought I shuffled that. This is whoever watched the video the other day and you trying to model. And you coming out here again and you trying to model. You're going to be modeling, okay? Prophecies must be fulfilled, all right? You could be in a divine coven, okay? You could be in your midlife. Your divine union was delayed because you would have uh, denied this extraordinary love, okay? And that's all I have for you. I hope you enjoy this reading and you have a beautiful day.